A Magitek armor. Dangerous? This particular model poses a mild to moderate threat. The short version? Somewhat dangerous. Marshal, you'd have to be pretty badass to take that down, right? Think you're up to it? Let's see what you can do. Oh, I'm supposed to fight them, huh? I thought it was maybe a stealth segment. Alright, let's do this then. Oh, there's something. I thought there was something there for a moment there. Where? Okay. M. A. Velis. They're both. They're both called that. Okay, sure. Whoop. Here we go. Damage time. You're staying nice and vulnerable, aren't you? Now we attack from behind. Whoop. Okay. That's a lot of damage. Wow. That's one hell of an AoE. Those look like they're dangerous to be around. I feel like I was pro proven correct, more or less. Is anyone down right now? Gladio will do better over time. That tank's pretty far away. Hey, Gladiolus, you want to auto-heal a little bit? Eh, you'll be fine. Everything's fine. Just don't stand in the explosives and you'll, you'll do better. Let's see, if I'm careful, I can run around this guy and attack him from behind. That'd probably help. Okay, those are, those are nasty. Ow. 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 So it can just keep attacking you. Ow. Well, I got him, but now I'm dying. There we go. Well done, man. Thank Ooh. You, praise from the marshal is praise indeed. There's a big nasty explosion. Should have scanned them. I assume that when they fall over like that, yeah, they're clearly in a pool of oil, so I'm sure if I hit them with a fire attack, that they'd be super damaged to the point. I really wish spellcasting was just a normal thing you just do, like in normal games, and not a weird thing you you like get inventory items for and have to carefully prepare in advance and stuff like that. Just because it'd be, it would just be more fun if I was just like, oh, weak to fire, boom, fire, like, and I have to like react constantly to all these different weaknesses over time. It's like, the way that they restrict it, it makes it less fun. Just, like I, I would, t I would take it being less powerful but more accessible over it being powerful but inaccessible yourself, or annoyingly accessible. Because they're most, I feel like the the current system mostly is going to push most players to not use magic unless they feel like they have to. Because it feels like something you have to go out of your way for. I'm getting stomped. Oops, that's not what I was going for. There we go. How you feeling, Axeman? Oh, oh, I missed my chance. <laughs> Attack no one, because the fight's over, apparently. Oh, the fight's not over, there's more. Oh, I'm, all, I'm all out, though. Fun time. You got all those arms at your disposal. Incoming pain. I just, I, for some reason, I really like the, uh, the heavy swords, which is really unusual for me. That's like the specific thing I would normally be unlikely to use. Blindside. Yay. Yep. I have to wait for my attack then, and, and there we go. We got to hit things for once. You all right, Highness? Of course. And you, Marshal? No problem. We're just stocking up on experience at this point. This is welcome. The empire is everywhere. See your oh. opponents for what they Hi. are. Hi. Gotcha. Alright, I might as well try this then. Uh Crap, do I have fire? Is that the one I didn't craft? Fira. Um, and apparently I have an extra slot now too. So Fira. Boom. That was purple, so that's... Wait, that means less damage? I should have... I guess I should scan it. I figured that this is in a giant pool of oil, so it's going to take bonus fire damage, right? I guess I was wrong. 
It's vulnerable to lightning. It's resistant to fire. That's a weird visual tell. I, I mean, it's a machine, so it's normal for it to be resistant to lightning. I get that much. But it's weird how it's uh, in a giant pool of oil in a video game, which is like universal language for this character. This thing is currently vulnerable to fire attacks in this giant pool of oil. I have not prepared lightning. I also don't really want to spend two magic on the same on the same enemy. So back to swords, which is also what it's weak against. We. Nope, fire bad. Fire bad. Fire bad. Oh, did I? Does it? Oh, it, th it thinks I. It thinks I fled the fight. Wow. Oh, whoa. Uh, surprise additional combatants. This game has a surprisingly low bar for uh, fleeing a fight. You 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 step you step five feet away. Therefore, you're clearly trying to escape the fight, even though you're. Even though it's a game that has long-range attacks like guns and teleport attacks. No wimping out. Let's move. Oh my God! How much experience did I just get? Don't get used to it. I'll be gone before you know it. Why though? Enjoy it while I can. No, stick with us. You're useful. Just stay here forever. Oh, that was so much experience. A giant hairy horn. That's uh. Wow. Yeah. I'm gonna get my money's worth out of that ten, that ten thousand gil. Apparently, hopefully, I'll get a bunch of AP out of that too. Any more giant robots want to fall relatively easily and give me like another thousand experience today? No. I'd really appreciate it. I was not looking at stamina again. Whoops. Can I just fight the ships? <laughs> if I hit it enough, it'll explode and give me experience. Right? That's how video games work. Can you, you can't open these. Other video games have trained me to think that green things that are clearly crates would be openable. <laughs> Grab what we can here before we move on. Oops. No, don't jump. Oh, we, we grabbed it all. Okay. So here's how we get into this place, because we saw this earlier. Can I break this? Answer is yes. No particular reason to, but yes. And it explodes into fire, because of course it does. Dark down here. Here's where we go our separate ways. No! Take this key. It unlocks the doors to the other tombs. Seek them out and lay claim to the power they hold. You'll need it. And what will you do? Keep an eye on the Nifs. Find out what they're up to. But you should focus on your own task. Showtime. I will. You take care. Here we go. Keep it real, huh? The power of kings. Search the royal huh? tomb. Look, there's at a door. Kietrich's trench. What is this place? It appears to have been a shelter. People lived here? Those seeking refuge from war, most likely. Wars. Huh. What are they good for? Wonder if anyone's still living here. Okay, Prompto, you need to chill out with the references. They're getting huh. weird. What's this? The cable? Wonder where it leads. We can follow it and see. I know my live commentary often shouts nonsense, but when it's a written character, it feels weird sometimes. War, huh? So what are clear. they good for? Might still run. Sweet, it works. Oh, then there was light. Oh. Do we have a map of this region? We do. Cool. Oh man, I do love me some light. There we go. He went war, huh? What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. And of course, he sang the Final Fantasy Victory song. I think that might be his uh, the role he makes in the, in the dialogue on a regular basis. Is that the uh? That'd be the localization team, huh? Because those kinds of references might not work <laughs> in the original language. Kick the can. You are killing me here, big guy. Are, just... are you trying to give me a heart attack or something? You should not be that afraid of perfectly well-lit hallways. Mostly well-lit hallways. Oh, it opens. This creepy Outlast door opens. I hate that noise! What, too atmospheric for you? Didn't expect the creepy out out uh, Outlast door to open. Well, there's something over here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. If it's all the same to you guys, I'd rather not get buried alive! Yeah, let us be quick. 
Yeah, there's a brief moment where I thought I might die there. <laughs> that was clearly a trap. Yeah. I can feel eyes on us. The second we turn our backs, bam! Could be a wuss. He's really acting like it's way darker in here than it really is. You can see every direction just fine. It only looks a little bit like Outlast. It's fine. It's fine. Chris Walker's not going to show up. There's not going to be teethless Hulk monsters trying to rip our throats out or anything. Uh, you need a key. We need a key. We're ultra powerful guys that can summon giant um, hulks of metal out of thin air hello? and blow things up with our minds. But we, we need Anybody a key. Home? I'm coming in. Uh, locked. Total hey, shocker. If something's worth locking up. It's worth seeking out. Or it's just a hazard, and Alsha wants you to keep the door locked so that your electric your uh, employees don't die uh, going into areas they're not supposed the to. Personally, don't mind either way. Give it up then. Press X to proceed. I love to proceed. It's my favorite thing. Hello. A dead end. I could have sworn this was it. Well, somebody oh. turn on a light. That was alarming. What happened? We don't know yet. Cool. I just want the item. I can't pick it up now. It's goblins! They're vulnerable to numbers of things, but mostly stabbing! Ow! Rock! That was abrupt. So the green stuff's definitely uh, prompto. I just saw him doing that. Ow! Rude. I'm gonna Zhao Yun, you asses. Are you ready for Dragon Spear? <laughs> Muso this. <laughs> There's no room to swing a sword in here. Just don't hit me. I apparently went. I apparently went full prompto during that fight. Oh, an Oracle Ascension coin. What in the world is that? Because that sounds odd. Key item maybe. Oracle Ascension Coin, coin issued to commemorate uh, Luca, uh, Luna Freya's Ascension as Oracle. It is limited run minting. So it's like a collectible. Oh, we have two now. We've had one before. Maybe we had to turn them in somewhere to a collector that likes to pay for them or something. The generator must have died, huh? Well, just gotta keep moving. See, now is a more fitting time for you to be freaking out, Prompto. Also, why don't you all have flashlight? You do have a flashlight. Why aren't your flashlights on? What are you doing? It's so dark in here. Why would your flashlights not be on? Could the PS4 not handle five, five uh, four, a light, uh, four mobile light sources in a room? Weird. Okay, now this really is Outlast. Now we're playing Outlast. And now Chris Walker is definitely going to grab me, unfortunately. Hey, an elixir. So I guess I accidentally went the right way, didn't I? If we're proceeding this smoothly. I'll try to pick up loose ends on the way out if I can. You never know which way it's going to be the forward one or not. There's a whole thing where the straightforward path is usually the one that's actually blocked and actually has a dead end with an eye in it. And the side paths are actually the way to go forward in a lot of RPGs now. Because otherwise the level will just be a hallway. If you just played it normally. Well, that sure seems important. Nope. Nope. Still no access. There's a side room over here. Probably also closed. Oh. Surprise. Nice. Another one. Up. Oh. Bad. Stop it. Gross. Go away. Did I? By the way, I uh. I, I, one of them told a potion or, or so stole a potion or elixir last fight. Did we lose it forever? Or did we get it back when we beat them? Because we did kill them, and it's not like they can take it. But not like they can teleport the items away, right? Prompto wasn't even in the fight. He just ran in here at the end. What are you doing, Prompto? <laughs> oh, no. Generator? There we go. Huh. What if the generator would open doors or something when you used it? That'd be kind of neat. Onwards. Oh. Press X to open. Psych! Jumping time! <laughs> oh, 
it's an, uh, definitely an ongoing thing that happens to me in a lot of RPGs where I, uh, I approach something to interact with it and then I jump up and down like a lunatic several times trying to uh, touch it because the same button is jump. And I didn't stop and plant my feet like a basketball ball player enough to call foul. That's explosive. Wait, hear that? Oh, it's absorbed. Oh, I can absorb it. Interesting. I thought it was just a hazard I had to watch out for or it would blow up. Is that suggesting that there's a fire there? vulnerable enemy around here? Hey, that opens. Now we're in the bathroom. Uh, nothing. That's weird. I'm gonna get I'm about to get attacked by Wall Rider. <laughs> oh. What are you? Oh, it's Tranchla. Ow. A tranchula with glowing red eyes, apparently. Vulnerable to guns and daggers and burning. Burning. I shouldn't use fire right now. It's a confined space and everyone in my party's probably gonna die. And uh it's also a weak enemy that I shouldn't be worried about. On this difficulty, I wonder why there even is a wait timer. It what can I say? Alright, you hate bugs. Me? Yeah. Can't stand them. Same here. Icky. Icky. Ooh, this looks promising. In an ominous sort of way. Stay sharp. It strikes me as odd that there's a wait timer for pausing because it's such an alarmingly long wait timer that it seems like it's negligible to even bother. Prompto. So you have a bio blaster, which is the poisonous mist. Mist. Now we have an auto crossbow option here. P uh, powerful shock wave against foes. Files a barrage of crossbow bolts. Gives him bonus health and bonus 10% shot damage, but less a less effectiveness. Might be a cool trick to have though. Honestly, I just want to see it used in the field. I like the uh, the weapon, the idea of machinery weapons because they remind me of uh, what's it called? They remind me of uh, Devil May Cry 4's weapon with the. It was like a book. Uh, was it Pandora's box or Pandora or something? It was a book. It was a book that, or no, it was a briefcase. I think that would open up into like twelve different completely nonsensical weapons that were all crazy designs and stuff. And that was just kind of fun. I should equip the bio blaster. Why not? Look where you're going. Didn't mean to do that. It really does look like a crazy lancer. Actually, no, no. I should let him use the the crossbow, the new trick. Uh, I can I can always switch it out between fights too to experiment with it. I wonder if I can specialize in gear in this game, if that's even a valid option. Because that just sounds fun, honestly. Gear sounds like a fun thing to specialize in, because it's just like, I get a toy box! Just a whole toy box! Let's use four different gear items, because they're so varied. But they might, they might not be that varied, though. It's just the first two I've found sound kind of varied. What, do I, what am I fighting right now? There's a weird blob directly above me. That's... Oh, no. Is that a super spider? What is that? Whoa. What are you? Just gonna slowly fill this one up. It's a Arkine? Ar Arachne? So I think what it says, it's the obligatory spider lady of video games. Weak, vulnerable against machinery. What a coincidence. Okay, and fire. Also with it, something I'm ready for. Alright, let's get rid of the block. Haha! -ha. Parry strike. Ow. Can I even parry with this weapon? That looks like it's gonna hurt. Ooh! Wasn't expecting it to go in that angle. Oh, I'm frozen. Okay. That apparently can happen. Damage time. Oh. I'm trying to use it. Ow. So I guess you have to charge it up for a while. Looks like it. Ow. Alright, this might not be a good time to experiment with a weapon I don't know how to use. Ow. Ow. Somebody revive me, please. Please? Please? What's wrong with you? You're right. You were like right on top of me. All right, fine. Noctis. 
All right. Now let's be very careful. How are we? Getting by. Links, come on, let's link strike it. Let's link strike it. Ow. My life is pain. Just gonna stay in evasive mode for a moment here. Okay, prompto. Let's deal with that real quick. Oh, butt strike. Oh, well, there I go. Help. 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 Alright, this one has some tricks for it for me. It's fine. There's a nasty... There's a very bad time to try to play with my new, uh... My new, uh, Bio Blaster toy. <laughs> Blindside Link. There we go. Put it in the books. It's history now. <laughs> Put it in the books. It's history now. The only thing sillier than that quote was the fact that the two of them said it together, which means that they say it together on a regular basis, probably. I can't save. I want to save. It's been a while since I've saved. Like a distressingly long time. So this now opens from behind. So you definitely can't go that way. Probably should try to deal with people's health situation here. So, no, right? That only doesn't help with the maximum hit points. The high elixir will max hit points and MP. Yep. There we go. All right. So bad time to play with the bio blaster. But I want to play with it. Uh, I can't even use the bio. I can't even use it outside of combat. I wanted to charge it up and see what it looks like. Is this right? Do you have a joke? Sadly, no one's laughing. Also, every time you switch what your currently equipped weapon, everyone flips out like you're attacking them. That's. I feel slightly odd. So I can crawl through there, or I can go what? Is there just a normal hall over here? Yep. Let's see. I don't know which one. To, uh, oh, there's a dead end. Never mind. Yeah, I was gonna say I wasn't sure which one to think goes forward versus which one goes to a side path, and I'm trying to pick up as many side paths as I can. Here we go. Alright, so next time I find some dumb level 2 saber tusks, I'll try to blast them with my blaster to figure out how that works. I think you have to charge it up and release it. But didn't really get a good feel for how, what I was supposed to do with That's it yet. Weird. The hell? The hell? What? There's a tunnel. Oh, the door? How'd you see that? It was dark. <laughs> Can't go that way. Can I go under here? Go on. Go on. Why can't I go down there? Explore! <laughs> You've already crouched through other stuff. Alright, well, it's on the map, but for some reason I can't go there yet. Oh well. Still can't save. Hopefully there's some sort of decent quick uh, checkpoints in here. So Noct borrows the old king's powers. Hmm. More or less. At this rate, he'll soon rival his father's legacy. The copycat king. Adeline. Well, what's it like? Hmm. 
Like I've got some tricks up my sleeve. No need to put on a magic show for us. But it never hurt to practice. So now I've got two of these. What do I do now? Head back out? Oh, I can return to the entrance. I'm gonna say no. Just because I want to backtrack a bit. Bummed out I can't go here, though. Oh, now I can. Well, now of course I will. Oh, yeah, I can't save while I'm doing this. Let's head on forward. Let's see what else is in here. Maybe there's more powers? Yeah, they still won't let me save. Uh. Um, oh, it's door. What's this? What's what? This is supposed to keep us out? Or keep something far more dangerous in. Totally thought it was a mouth or something. No dice. Won't budge. For every lock, there exists a key. Or like a magical key that can unlock any door. Like from the video games. Or that. Meta character. He's the meta character that makes cultural references. War, huh? What is it good for? Da -na 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 -na. This is like in the video games. <laughs> oh, there we go. So uh, I assume, I don't know, maybe uh, the immortal guy will give us that at some point. The uh, key to that opening. So there's where I went and crawled the first time. So let's see if there's anything further down Ever here. I wonder if people like died here and their tormented souls just sort of remained behind. <laughs> Different door, same story. No luck here either. Where are the keys at? Are you a key? Maybe this way? Yeah. This isn't. I don't know. Whatever it is, it's playing with us. Someone's still screwing around and making noise? It, can't, it better not be the spider, because we already took care of the spider. So something else? Hey, wait. What? Need to brace for this. Okay, I'm gonna count to three. On three, you open the door. Got it? Hmm. All right. Okay, here I go. One, two, three! Didn't open huh? it. Um, you're not gonna... Yeah, not feeling it. <laughs> Maybe it'll be a Goblin King or something. Uh oh. Huh, this one won't open either. Enough of this. Come on, man. Don't lose your cool. Huh, says the panicky one. Just hit it. Just hit it till it opens. Have you seen what we can do? We fought. Ro we fought giant mechs it outside. I don't see anywhere to go. I think the sound effects might just be coming from the Spider Queen thing, and it may be uh, what maybe a. Like, maybe they expected you to hear all the noises before you defeated it. Wasn't there before. Oh. Never mind. We are getting new sounds. An item popped up. Is this door going to be open now? Or is there a new item anywhere? Locked. Let us find another way. This game's messing with me. Noises are happening. So that wasn't there before. So now what? Can I go down the well? It probably came out of the well. Ah, uh, where'd the sound come from? Is it- is this door open? Something's happening here. Oh, oh there it is. Who plays Hi. Lurk if I've ever... Oh, I... totally. Maxed out all of them now. Elect- oh. Electrolic condenser. What does that mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Um. Don't see it here. Leisure goods? No. Memories? No. Treasures. Oh, it's, just tre it's a component that some Imperial military. It's a component from some Imperial military electronic device. It could be sold for a small amount of gill. That's it. I might as well craft something. Let's see, I'm missing... I have Blizzard and Fire prepped already, so I could make something out of lightning. Just jam it all in there. There we go. 
And should I even put an item in this one? Super restorative. <laughs> Gradually restores hit points. I don't really like using items on these because I don't know what, what, what to do with it. Oh, but now I've done... i got to undo that. It's fine. There, we got a lightning thing prepped. Now give me your power. Eh, it filled it halfway up already. So this is going somewhere. Really don't like how it won't let me save. I'm worried about that. Maybe I should have gone back to the entrance just to just to do that. Rusted bit. Ow, ow. That. There's wiring going down here. Oh, I thought that was an item, but it was like water dripping down. It still opens. Oh, this feels like a bad idea. Let's do it. It's safe right now. It's exciting exploration time. Let's go. Worst case scenario is we die horribly and I lose potentially hours of progress. Yay! Hey, did uh. Here they come. Where are they? Oh, there they are. Bringing pain. Ow. Brain. Uh, pain was brought to me. Ow. Rude. There we go. Eh, you'll be fine. Just take him out. Yep, there it goes. Five experience. It's it's so little experience that it actually takes a long time to get through each individual number of the experience because the uh, the experience always oh, takes the same amount of time to calculate and like pour into your pool in that one little number thing. So it goes, it's like it's like a countdown in this case, like five, four, three, two, one experience. Ah ah ah. Oh, that was the back of this door. We did it. We looped around. Why did why did it do that? <laughs> They're just screwing with us. Any more banging sounds to indicate that there's more puzzle, or is that the end of the game? Oh, this one's open now. That was closed a moment ago. So now what? Oh, the door goes to a different floor entirely. There's an item over there. Is this a dead end? Oh, it loops around to the previous door. Which now opens. Looping... That should loop right back to the entrance of the entire place, right? Yeah. That's a pretty small loop. Doesn't really serve much purpose. Okay, so what's down here then? This is a fun little dungeon to explore. I like this. So we're gonna get attacked, I'm sure. Above us. Look out. Oh, that wasn't very nice. I should have hit the dodge button. My bad. There's our ether. But why did I, why did I come down here just for that? Can I press you? No. Why did I come down here? Why did I come down here? Why am I here? Fully restores MP. Doesn't seem like that big of a deal. Weird. Okay. Well, the door opened. Were there other locked doors that are now open? Oh, those were cave-ins, right? Yeah, I feel like most of the other blocked passages were actually cave-ins. That might be it. That may or may not be it. I don't know. If I miss out, if I miss out on some grand secret, maybe I'll come back. Maybe it's time to leave. Don't like the look of that ceiling. Yeah, long overdue for some TLC. Sure, hope it holds up. Yeah. Finally picked up. But I'd lost another king. <sighs> Just busy building my arsenal. Good to hear. I have a task for you. The Empire's begun construction of a new base along the road west to the sky. I need you to put it out of commission. If left unchecked, it will cost us access to the west and all the royal tombs that lie beyond. I believe you've met Monica. She can fill you in on the details. 
Go see her. What's up? Ah, uh, people to see, bases to burn. Let's go see Monica at the outpost. The sky. I finally heard it said out loud, or at least I finally noticed it said out loud. You did spy a large structure? Yeah, hard to miss an ominous thing like that. It ain't gonna be easy taking down a whole stronghold. Can we really do this? The Marshal believes we can, or he wouldn't have asked us. But first things first. Right. Let's head back to the outpost. Careful, it's night time. We wouldn't want to fight that anything spooky. <laughs> It's actually really convenient. I happen to be emerging just in time for the uh, sun to basically be coming up because it tends to rise around like th 4 or 5 a.m. basically. Right now it's 3-ish. Which is why you already see a, a bit of it there. So we should already be in the territory of the of the uh, schedule where I can like do fast traveling or at least driving. Oh, nice here. Yeah. Because nighttime proves to be a relatively effective block on driving, unless you can take down those monsters. Which, admittedly, I haven't actually looked at those giant sword monsters to see if they're powerful or not. I've always stayed away from them. But yeah, they definitely block your road. And that means you can't use your car anymore, and you have to run around on foot. And that significantly restricts travel. Oh, we made it back. Where's Monica? Right here. Oh, there she is. Your Highness, the Marshal has apprised me of the plan. We found a back door into the Imperial base. I'll mark the route on your map. The way is secure. You should be able to gain entry relatively easily. I wonder if this is going to be how I get past the uh, the blockades. Oh yeah, Declaration of War is right next to that blockade. That must be how I get access to this next chunk of the map. Yep, there's the sky. It's even listed there. And once I break through, then I should be able to do these quests that, we, that have been waiting for me over there. Oh! What's that? Cindy has a side quest for us. It's an emergency. 